We continue to monitor the standoff situation in the community of Sayre in Pennsylvania. Police have now been outside a home on Wilbur Avenue in Sayre for several hours. Matt Jarko has been at the scene for most of the afternoon. He joins us now on the phone. Matt, what is the latest that you can see? Jeff, it looks like police are still getting ready to enter the home where the man has barricaded himself this morning. They haven't been able to make contact with that resident since they arrived hours ago, as you mentioned. Now, this all started when they got a call from a neighbor who told them about the resident. Police say when they arrived, others were actually inside that building. There are no hostages now that they believe, and they don't believe there's any injuries either. They're looking to keep it that way, of course, but they are being careful. I'm told that the gentleman inside has high-powered rifles and explosives, and at this point they are considering that he could be suicidal as well. So right now in the latest couple of hours here, they have broken some windows with rubber bullets to get sight of the man that they can then enter. They're preparing to do so. They've called in a New York State Police entry team coming in. We're pretty far away, but we can see them starting to huddle up and gather. There's been a lot of activity in the past couple of minutes as police uh, prepare for entry, but they have not done so and they have not made contact with the person who has barricaded himself at this time. Matt, are they still trying to protect yourself and residents? Are you still as far back as you were before? It was quite a distance. Absolutely. We are still a couple hundred yards away. Police are still blocking off all access points. And there are a lot of residents out there here. There have been throughout the afternoon a lot of residents just kind of watching the scene as it develops. But as I mentioned, still a couple hundred yards away. Police are treating this with a lot of care. They're keeping everybody careful, including the residents and us outside. And we understand, too, this is a busy part of town, a, a hospital nearby, yes? Yeah, this is right across the street from the hospital, actually, near downtown. And the hospital has canceled all afternoon appointments. They were very careful with that. They wanted to keep everybody away because, as you mentioned, right next to a hospital where there is a ton of traffic going in throughout the average day. It was uh, an ENT building where the hospital, uh, Guthrie Robert Park Packer, excuse me, had said that they uh, closed for the day. Uh, also a school in the area and uh, the downtown area of Sayre there as well. Matt Jarko continues to be on the scene. We'll check back with him later on from Sayre, Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. And keep it right here on Time Warner Cable News. We'll have all the latest on this continuing standoff situation.